Hi, my name is Bob Grunier, and I'm a volunteer with the Martin Fleischmann Memorial Project. So overnight and into the mid of the afternoon, here I have had the black sand from Kerala exposing both the scintillator of the radio code spectrometer and the pancake of the uh, radio scan. And uh, we definitely have some peaks. Uh, which we will look at in more detail in a minute when I plug it into the computer. And that is showing some very clear indications that we have some radio isotopes in there. And if we actually look at the data for the gamma here on the radio scan, you can see that it is 0.8 microsieverts per hour from this source with a high accuracy of plus or minus 1%. And this is gamma because we put on the uh, lead screen last night. So this will be screening out all of the beta particles and it, the actual plastic of the container screened out the vast majority of the alpha particles as we saw in the previous video. So this is just the gamma exposure that you would have from this sample. If you're actually lying on the beach as I did many times or swimming in the waters of that beach then you would be exposed to the gamma, the beta and the alpha. <clears throat> so there we go, I turned to both of the alarms off on these uh, detectors because otherwise it would have been screaming at me for a long period of time. So I'm going to stop this sampling going on here now and I'm going to look at the data in more detail to see what isotopes we might have in there. 